guys returning home after my long walk I feel exhausted already <laughs> I saw the whales Pleasant walk here. That's good to see the whales, the four of them together. The seagulls were flying over them. And then they're opportunistic when the whales get the fish or something or you know, and then fish sweep down hoping to get the fish out of their mouths. Hasid Mystic Balsim Tov Balsim Tov used to uh, go and you know pray in a certain place in the forest when he died his successor didn't know where Balsim Tov prayed he said to the God, I don't know where my master prayed, but since you are omnipresence, it shouldn't matter where I pray. So he started praying somewhere else. And he died. And his disciple didn't know where his master prayed, so he started praying wherever he felt like and he, he died and his disciple decided to pray at his own home he didn't go to the forest he said since you are omnipresence what does it matter you are everywhere So the God is everywhere, present in everything, in these flowers, and they see everything. Therefore, it's not necessary just to go to temple to pray or monastery or, you know, churches. Just, just to see God in everything, you see, that's important.
God, that's what I do. He said, I watch my inner world and you watch your outer world. It's just the direction is different. You guard the tips from entering the house and I guard the thoughts wandering off. So we are both watchmen. Just the direction is different, he said. So the meditation is that constant watching being attentive, being aware. And there is no question of controlling, you see. Just watch how thought arises and comes along and you know, passes by. And instead of another thought arises, it passes by. And there is a gap in between these two thoughts. There's a small gap. And intelligent means, the word intelligent is quite, you know, uh, useful word. It comes from interlegere, which means to read between the lines. What is that to read between the lines? That, that is space. To read that space is intelligent. So intelligent and intellectual doesn't, doesn't mean the same thing. Intellectual means you know to gather knowledge, information and so on. One can go to university. But uh, uh, an intellectual person may not be intelligent. A farmer in the faraway village could be more intelligent than university professor. You see? So intelligent has nothing to do with intellectuality, with the knowledge. It's just the, to be able to read that space in between two thoughts is what intelligent is. 
usually when people if people mix these two words intelligent and intellectual when somebody has so much knowledge they call oh he's so intelligent but I think that's quite wrong should be said he's so intellectual not intelligent Watching with unwavering attention. The word attention means to attend. And you can only attend here now. You can't attend anything in the, in the past or in the future. You can only attend here. What is actually happening, you can attend. So when thoughts are coming and going, be attentive to that. Be aware.